Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel or welcome if you are new. I'm Eliandra and welcome to another townie makeover. I'm really excited for this one but just a little disclaimer. This is one of the most drastic makeovers I have done. I completely changed Caleb around and I'm sorry if you don't like that but I really like his new look. I just know that you guys really when it comes to these makeovers it's important to keep to their character their personality and their sense of style and i kind of threw that out the window when it came to caleb vator but i hope you guys understand why but i had so much fun with this i know these sims are some of your guys's favorites so we are doing the vator siblings today lilith and caleb they are both vampires they come from the sims 4 vampires game pack and they live in forgotten and holo and i think caleb is like such a fan favorite he is someone a lot of us have our female sims go after because he makes a pretty good looking baby daddy um i was never really that into him like i really dislike his look i don't like how he looks at all i don't like his haircut obviously it's yeah some people like that but to me it's just not my thing and obviously he's wearing like these super old-fashioned clothes which makes sense because he's supposed to be a vampire and in a lot of different lores vampires are immortal they don't die which means he has probably lived for centuries but he just doesn't look like he belongs in this century so i kind of modernized him i hope you guys like his new look he's very good looking and i really like his new look but it's just it's not the same as it was before <laughs> anyways we're starting off with lilith i am making over this dark forms as well so in sims for vampires once your vampire sim does something vampirish so if they want to like turn into a bat or if they want to go and use their vampiric powers to like what do they do the people they kind of like hypnotize hypnotize them or whatever they can also drink their blood they will swap on over to their dark form and they can look all scary and vampirish i made that into a word or they can literally look the same like uh, Caleb's dark form was literally the exact same as his normal human form so uh, Lilith's was a little bit different as you can already see she had like darker skin tone I think she had like red eyes and these cracks on her face so I'm gonna do that for both of them and this was a lot of fun to do they are actually siblings so they are brother and sister and I think Lilith was turned by <gasps> what's his name Vladislaus right Vladislav Strout, I think you can see in the trailers that he turned Lilith and then Caleb was turned by some other female sim, I don't remember, but they're both pretty good vampires. They both don't want to drink blood from humans or human sims. They want to drink from plasma fruits. So in their household description, it says that as well. I'm going to read it for you guys. It says, the Vator siblings moved into Forgotten Hollow a few years ago and are striving to make it their home. This can be quite challenging at times since they are not exactly on the best terms with Vladislav Strout, but when asked, they only ever mention a difference in their culinary tastes. So that is the Vator household description. I really like Lilith's new look. Obviously, she's got that like gothic vibe going on a little bit. She also was wearing like a more old fashioned look. I didn't really like her outfit either. I tried to go for something a little bit similar to keep her vibe. And I also didn't want her to look like a teenager. I don't know if I did a good job. She's a young adult. I mean, she's probably in her 20s or early 30s, but she looks really pretty now. I love the earrings. These are pretty cool um, jeans that I gave her some heels. I mean, she looks pretty badass. She's a vampire after all and gave her some dark makeup like she already had. And this hair just looked really gorgeous on her. I love it. She doesn't have the short bangs anymore but honestly I tried so many different hairs and this one was my favorite and then we're gonna make over her dark form as well I'm just gonna copy this over to there and then give her some cracks etc on her face and off camera I also changed her eyes to red which you will see in the screenshots in just a little bit but I think she turns out pretty darn cool and then we're gonna do Caleb her brother in a second and by the way, who else like thinks that this is like such a family based on the Vampire Diaries? Because the Vampire Diaries is one of the most popular vampire related thing out there, apart from like Twilight. And then there's like 
True Blood? Is there something else that is like really famous with vampires? I don't even know, but Vampire Diaries was really famous when it was out. And obviously the main characters are the Salvatore brothers. And then we have here, Vator siblings. It's literally the same name. Mine is the Sal in the beginning. Like they could have only been more ob obvious if they made them two brothers instead of a brother and a sister. So I definitely think it comes from the Vampire Diaries. I don't know. I mean, Vator is a cool last name, but nobody beats the Salvatore brothers. Which one of them is your favorite, by the way? I am Team Damon all the way. <laughs> Anyways, here is her before and after pictures. I like how she turned out. I think she looks really, really, really pretty. And I didn't change her a lot. I changed her features just a little bit. As you know, in these makeovers that I've been doing in the last couple months, I have changed their features just a tiny little bit to match my aesthetic a little bit more. I don't change the presets. I only like push and pull a little bit if I find something a little bit unrealistic or just I just want them to look a little bit more like my sims that's kind of the point of this series right now so I did change her features a tiny bit but not that much she's also really jacked like holy heck that girl has got a six pack but yeah here is um Caleb oh my god I honestly did not change almost anything about him the biggest change that I did with his face was his eyes I made his eyes a lot smaller that's like the only thing everything else I did like the most minimal changes like he's a very good looking sim like this definitely makes sense why he would make such a good baby daddy because he has got amazing genes just like the eyes were a little bit too big for my taste the eyebrows also make quite a big change and then honestly I think almost any guy looks better with some stubble and I am weak when it comes to like guys with stubble or like beard so I just I just want to give it to all these sims that look so good with it so uh, Caleb did not used to have a stubble or any kind of beard and he does now so it is a huge huge change for his look and also his hairstyle was not my thing did not like it a single bit I tried so many different hairs that were a little bit similar but they just didn't look good on him and then I tried this hair and he just looks so dang good that I just had to go for it I know it's not it doesn't look anything like Caleb but you know it's still the same sim with like the most minimalistic genetic changes and then like a huge makeover and then to make him look a little bit more like mysterious or like vampirish or that something is going on I gave him a huge scar his face I have been wanting to use those we got those from the Sims 4 get famous they're to do with the acting career they're like makeup but actually they're not makeup they're in skin, skin details but um I just really wanted to use them and I thought he looked so cool with one. <laughs> I mean I don't know I just I think it made him look more mysterious so Caleb has now got a massive scar across his eye half of his face but I think it looks cool and I did keep his more sophisticated look a little bit we're going with this long jacket and he's got like a button shirt underneath some like uh dress pants what are these called like suit pants sorry like he's dressed up that's what I'm trying to say so he does still have the sophisticated look going on it's just not as old school he doesn't look like he's still living in like I don't even know what century that like <laughs> suit and jacket was from but anyways this is his dark form I am getting some serious Elijah Michelson vibes from this guy right now especially with the different scars I mean the different vampire like cracks and whatever on his face and then the red eyes and the skin tone and I'm gonna give him a suit I wanted him to wear a suit like definitely that's where the Elijah Michelson comes through I think he looks really cool but yeah um these guys will be in the gallery eventually where you can find them under my username which is Eliandra YC or under the hashtag Eliandra I promise soon I will go and put all of my townies on the gallery so you can download them here are his before and after pictures and I have some um photo shoot pictures in the end give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it subscribe if you're new here and let me know what you thought about their makeover in the comments down below and who should I do next give me your ideas I hope you guys enjoyed I'll see you again soon and bye